America. That's what I'm saying. You have to be careful, guys. Because everyone... America isn't as bad as y'all make it sound because how come all these people in third world countries want to come to America? They want to get married to an American for a reason. Are your parents divorced? Nope. They've been married since they were 19 years old. Um, they're like 40 right now. I mean, they're young, but they have been married since 19. You're from Israel. I am praying for your country. I have family who lives in the Middle East and I know what it's like. I know it's hard. Well, I don't know what it's like, but I do know it's hard. Do you think that obesity is something that should be criticized? Criticized? I don't think we should criticize anyone. Do I think we should be like, all bodies are beautiful? No, because you're unhealthy. If you're unhealthy, that's not beautiful. What's healthy for you is gonna be different from others. If you're a little heavier set, that's completely okay. But obesity, no. That's a no-go. We should like make people aware that you shouldn't be, you shouldn't be like, you know, you shouldn't be obese. That's not good. I don't think we should shame people though. That's not what God would want us to do. Forget politics, you're too beautiful for that. Um, thanks for the compliment, but like, I think it's good for me to be aware of kind of like what's happening in the world. And I like getting involved in deeper conversations. So, so I like actually know what I'm doing, know what I'm talking about, know what I support and what I don't support. Um, you would be a good wife. Thank you. What Arab country do you want to go to? Uh, I have, I mean, I wouldn't go, right now it's too dangerous to go anywhere, but Q8. Both are healthy. Obese people are healthy? No, they're not. Are y'all brainwashed? I'm 5'7 and 150 pounds alignment is 6'4, 350. What does that mean? Like, you're beautiful. Thank you. Just join. What's the politics? Pe people are asking, like, about obese people. And I said obese people aren't healthy. We shouldn't be, like, praising them for being obese. Are you healthy? Yes. Do you work out? Yes. Do you have muscles? Yes. Um, I have struggled with, like, an eating disorder. And it's on and off when I get like really stressed. Like right now my hair is falling out. Like I'm not as healthy as I normally am. That's just me being honest because that's gonna fluctuate obviously. Um, but I do try to be like really healthy, eat healthy. I stay away from like alcohol, smoking, don't smoke or anything. And I don't like getting fast food. What are included in a girl's measurements? What do you mean? Do you think if Trump changed his name to Trump Delicious, he would be more delicious? Uh, I don't know how to answer that question. Very interesting. Thank you for the gift. Would you date a Jew? Not me. Um, probably not because I think my views are too different from them. I, yeah, I don't see myself dating a Jew just because like our views are too different. You think obese should be able to feel some comfort in their bodies. I mean, they shouldn't hate themselves. That'd be horrible. But I mean, when you get to that point of just being so fat, you can't even move and do like the things you used to love doing, like you're not gonna be comfortable in your own body. So you have to not be lazy get up and do something about it so you can like live life how you used to live it. Are you on Facebook? No. I'm not on Instagram anymore either. You can follow me on Instagram. I might get on it like every blue moon, but I, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
what is your name on instagram it's brooklyn cromer i think it's the same as my tiktok but it's also my tiktok bio do you have biceps i have little bitty biceps i'm not really that big <laughs> Are you a fitness trainer? No, not officially. Beautiful name, thank you. How to reprogram myself into eating healthy food. Do you want me to be honest? Like y'all, I could talk all day about this. Literally all day, this is my specialty. Um, honestly, it starts with dedication, not motivation, dedication. We'll learn the differences, look it up watch videos on dedication versus motivation and learn that you have to retrain and rewire your brain to believe what is good for you so like if you aren't healthy you eat unhealthy foods like you might think like right now if you're constantly eating fast food unhealthy food junk food like brownies all the time chips all the time in your head you think like this is good for me, this is what I want, my body's craving this. But your body actually wants healthy food, your body isn't craving that, you just, you know, your brain's just used to it. So you have to like be dedicated enough to make the switch and eventually you're only gonna crave healthy food and it's gonna be way easier. You just have to like get past the whole like dedication part. I'm not on WhatsApp. What is BDD? Um, no one lives in the Middle East, no one wants to live there. Literally, yes, people live in the Middle East. Um, it's really not that bad, guys. I mean, right now it's bad. That joke is a little too soon, meat lover. A little too soon. How many cheat meals can we have per week? So, for me, starting out, none, because you're going to get right back into that um, habit of eating unhealthy if you're just starting out, like, trying to eat healthy. So, like, no cheat meals at first. But, like, if you crave something, just listen to your body. Like, you'll learn, like... Oh, my body wants water. If you're craving like a Coke, maybe just get like lemon water, something, you know? Um, and then, you know, you just have to like learn your body, like really study your body. Um, it's actually eat cake and Mountain Dew. I mean, there's nothing wrong with having that. Like I drink, I drank a Coke like yesterday but it's like all moderation and also like the majority of my food. I'd say I'm 80% like healthy food, 20% like whatever else I'm craving. No, I don't live in the Middle East. I love cheeseburgers and fries too, but what I started doing is if I go out like with my friends to like a burger restaurant, what I do is instead of getting fries, I'll just like get a burger um, just like little, little stuff, you know, because it helps. Okay, so take creatine, 